Today on Block Success Journal, web hosting, specifically how to move to a new web host. Changing web hosts, moving from one web host to the other, it's, it's a lot like moving into a new house. It requires a lot of planning, packing, and then the actual move, and then unpacking, getting settled in the new place. Okay, so it's a little scary for a lot of people. It's kind of like getting that house, new house inspected, okay? You want to go to the new web host, create an account, check out their user interface, contact their support team, see how responsive they are. Yeah. You really want to test it out before you make the decision to jump in all the way. Yeah, maybe even get a temporary website set up, bang on it, whatever, make sure it works. Now, back up all your data. Before you go transferring anything, back up your stuff, download it to your hard drive just so you got it, and you can restore it just in case, okay? okay. Totally critical. Download a copy of all your stuff in your web account. I know this sounds a little technical, but especially if you're running something like WordPress, you'll need all your databases backed up, all your files that make up the WordPress install. Um, and your current web host actually should make it simple. They should offer something called cPanel. There should be a backup button in there somewhere. If you're not sure, that's why you, you have a, a managed web host. But I'll support take and say, I want to back up my stuff. How do I do it? They should be able to tell you. And just make sure you also download copies, uh, and this may or may not apply to you, but um, if you have images, videos, whatever, on a separate cloud host like we do, make sure you download all of those too. Everything that makes up your website, you should get a copy of. Absolutely. Okay, now, now it's time for the move, okay? The big move. It can be kind of scary, especially with your blog. There's a lot of things you may not think about. You know, you've got to transfer your new data to the web sub, notify your domain registrar, update your DNS. These are all things I'm like, oh my gosh, what do I have to do? This is complicated and downright, you know, you could really screw up your whole blog. This is why we like HostGator so much. They will actually migrate all your stuff over for you, okay? Now, once you get it all migrated over or if you have the new web host do it for you, test, 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 okay? Only close your old account after you've thoroughly tested the new website and make sure it works. Yep, make sure you got all the way on the other side before you burn that bridge. <laughs> so, have you ever changed web hosts before? How'd it go? Leave a comment.